him rest. Did you see it? The path of light. That's good, right? Means we might make it out of here alive. There you are. I'd hoped you'd make it through. But Moe didn't hear from you. Well, I'm glad you're here now. You had something to do with the light, right? I knew it! This is the end for Ketherick. Stuck up while you can. My store's always open to you. Just make sure you give Ketherick a few knocks for me, yeah? Premium trinkets and doodars! There you are, unfortunately. Ever since you arrived, things keep changing. I hate it! Would that I lived on an island, far away, all alone. Glad to see you again. I was afraid you'd get swallowed up by the shadows. Instead, you found us some cavalry. Very well done. The end's in sight. I can feel it. Watch yourself out there. Please. Watch yourself out there. People just ran off and said nothing. Adults always do this. I'll find out what's going on myself. Thank you very much. Don't be shy. Have a gander at the finest... The sky looks so pretty with the light. Whoever it is must be good. They must be. When it's quiet, I'm gonna follow the light. But I'll be safe, I promise. The light means that Ketherick will be gone soon, right? It is. I can tell by your face. Once Ketherick is gone, we can get out of here. I can't wait. name. He must know more. We need to rouse him. I saw a winged Asima fly overhead, and now an assault on Moonrise is brewing. Time is not on our side, I fear. We find Thaniel soon. Good. Its music might help restore him. Show it to him. Trap there. He needs help. Calm. Breathe. <laughs> You've been trapped in the shadow fell for a century. Take a moment to clear your mind. A century? You're Halsin. Thaniel said to find you. You must help him. Please. I will. But I need to know where Thaniel is. If I venture into the shadow fell blind, I will never find him. I'm not sure I can put it into words. The landscape there shifts and changes. Lavender. Whenever I saw Thaniel, I always smelled lavender. I can work with that. Rest now. Meet me by the lake shore. I have what we need to proceed, but I'll need your help. Be ready. This may prove perilous. Thaniel will be so scared there alone. 
We looked after each other for such a long time. I hope he's all right. Tear that tower down. We lost too many good people out here. Past a moonrise is opening up. Time for vengeance. Make them hurt, yeah? Thanks to you, we've got a chance to fight back. We'll make it count. Make those bastards pay. Hmm, something seems different. I don't know what, but I do know it's something. Hope we're not leaving. I wouldn't care to leave. I saw a very large heron flying overhead. I admit, it was rather beautiful. I believe we've said all we have to say. Scurry on now. left him behind. Now we can begin. Thaniel is trapped in the Shadowfell, but thanks to your efforts, I know where to look. Now I must go there, alone. No. This opportunity has been a hundred years in the making. It has to be me. And only me. But I didn't bring you here to witness an old druid's grandstanding. You have a part to play in this, and I trust you will play it well. With the Oak Father's blessing, I can infiltrate the Shadowfell, but doing so will sap my strength. I'll need your help if I'm to return. I need you to stay here, keep the portal open until I return, and defend it at all costs. No. If there's any interference with the portal, then our one chance is lost forever. And so am I. I'd rather have you by my side. But this is the only way. It took me years of study, of seeking the Oak Father's favor, to find a way to part the veil. Pray that this works. Oak Father, hear me, aid me. Force open the jaws of darkness. Make passage for your vessel of light. It's ready. I'll return with Thaniel as soon as possible. Stay close to the portal. Buy me what time you can.
Let's turn someone inside out. is my happy place. Tactical.
sense, Halsey. We just have to buy him a little more time. It's done. I have him. <gasps> but something's wrong. Dreadfully wrong. No. It can't be. Yes. I'll bring him back to camp. He'll be safest with us. I need to examine him. I need to understand what's wrong. It's almost like something's missing from him. Come see us when you can, and be careful out there. Forces may be rallying against Moonrise, but Ketherick Thorm is most dangerous when cornered. I know from experience. glimpse a young harper on the eve of battle against Thorn long ago. He and his comrades toast each other in last light. A faded memory of a boy and girl sharing their first kiss. Your own heart almost flutters in tune with theirs. Desperate prayers to Saluna echoing from the past. They did not save him. You can almost feel the heat from the forge. This one was once a blacksmith. You sense a fading echo of the person who once was, a dockhand. He did not ask for this.
any word? Something wrong. He withstood the shadows for so long. Whatever's overcome him now must be something different, something worse. I trust you and Halson to help him. He's a sweet soul, Thaniel. I can't wait for you to meet him. Soldier. Hello, my dear. You wanted something? Daniel is resting, but it's no easy slumber. I discovered what's wrong with him. The shadows rendered him in two when they bore him away to the Shadowfell. Half of his essence remained here, amidst the curse. What stayed behind would have been the strongest part of him. But after all these years left in the darkness, corruption must have taken hold. It's both simple and not. We need to find Thaniel's missing half and make him whole again. Only the missing half may not come willingly. The curse will have sunk its tendrils deep, twisting Thaniel's essence into something else. No matter how it's been twisted by the shadows, it is still part of Thaniel's essence. It will resemble him somehow, and may show signs of his power. Look for signs of life in the darkness, wildflowers where everything else is dead. The curse cannot subdue the power Thaniel bears. Not entirely. In fact, I saw just the sort before, not long after we first came within reach of the Shadow Curse. Fool that I am, I did not grasp their significance at the time. There is a ruin some way outside of Last Light. I caught a glimpse of fresh blooms there, but did not investigate further. I shall mark it upon your map. Let me help you then. Every moment counts, and I've asked much of you already without being at your side. If you want me, I'm yours. Against the curse, against the absolute... anything. Just say the word. Seems your ranks are quite packed. If some space frees up, I'll be ready for you. Go ahead. Darling, I'm hurt. I guess I'll spend my evenings lounging here while you do all the hard. It sounds awful. Thaniel still suffers. There'll be no improvement until his essence is restored, I fear. In truth, I'm not sure. This is beyond all reckoning. It's still part of Thaniel deep down, but it may not recognize that, or want to recognize that. Perhaps it can be reasoned with, but I'm not hopeful. Reason is not something that thrives amidst the Shadow Curse. Good. Now our roots can deepen. Together. 
Oak Father preserve you. Only by reputation. She was present when we marched against Ketherick Thorm, but on the far end of the battle lines from where I fought. And in the chaos that ensued, well, our forces were scattered. I led some to safety, but never learned of her fate. I'm glad to hear she survived. Though in truth, I should not be surprised. She was always said to be formidable and cunning. I could have learned much from her, no doubt. No matter how long I live, I will always strive to remain a keen pupil. Only a fool would think he could drink in all knowledge until none is left. There is always more. Nature's tapestry is infinitely complex. I cannot help but wonder how she would have handled some of the challenges I faced as Archdruid. Would she have helped the refugees? Defended the Grove? Controlled Korga? At least now we can benefit from her presence, and perhaps work to a common goal. Honestly, I never thought I'd make it that far. But the Absolute is a threat to all, and I promised I'd help you with your parasite. So, I'll remain with you. If you'll have me, that is. So do I, but one duty at a time. Given the circumstances, you're faring as well as can be expected, I suppose. It's true, and I can't imagine I helped with that. Sometimes I let the task at hand consume me, and people think I'm obsessed. Trust me, the day I no longer have to talk about the Shadow Curse will be a happy one. What would you like to know? I am? <laughs> Trust me, it's been said. You show more restraint than most in avoiding the subject until now. Who's to say? <laughs> perhaps there's a half-orc buried somewhere in my ancestry. Or perhaps not. Sometimes I think conventional wisdom is too narrow about what someone can or cannot be. Stranger things have most certainly happened. Hmm. I had a friend when I was young, long ago. He played with me in the forests where I grew up. But eventually I realized no one else had heard of him. It was Daniel, of course. Nature was my very first friend. I get older, but he hasn't changed a day. I knew then that I had to be more than a companion to him. I had to be a protector. <laughs> You're not a doppelganger, are you? Trying to study me to learn all my secrets so you can take my place? <laughs> Save for me. My line perished a long time ago. They rest in High Forest now, near the shade of the Grandfather Tree. The Grove became my family, with Sylvanus as my teacher. And now I have you. It was a long time ago. The wounds don't heal, but they become more bearable. I'm 350 years old. Of course there have been lovers. Just because I love nature doesn't mean I'm betrothed to it. Though sometimes, nature needs reminding. Well, uh, I didn't pick this scar up in battle. I was in wild shape, only I forgot it was the season when bears are particularly social. A she-bear claimed me as her own and did not appreciate being spurned.
Right now? I bed down alone, I'm afraid. <laughs> Perhaps once I talk less of curses and parasites, my fortunes will improve. Hmm. Um... I suppose you wouldn't be shocked to learn I love animals and nature? <laughs> I, I know, I know. Well-trodden territory. Uh, well then, let's see. Um... I whittle in my spare time? And I've something of a sweet tooth. Although everyone's very amused when I say I like honey. Hmm. Ornaments, utensils, and ducks. I like ducks. I like what I like. Once you get to my age, you realize there's little point in denying yourself, so long as others aren't affected. Thank me by returning the favor, why don't you? <laughs> Come on. I'm sure you've something better than carving wooden ducks. Well, they are fierce creatures from what I understand. But, as long as you avoid the high seas, I think you can consider yourself safe. Anytime. Druids and Harpers joined together to put a stop to Ketherick Thorm. We marched on Moonrise, and after much fighting, we prevailed. Even in defeat, though, Ketherick turned to Shah. Not long after we sealed him away in his tomb, the Shadow Curse took hold. No one had seen the likes of it before. No one knew how to react. Then it started to claim all those within its reach. Those who had survived the battles now fell to the Shadows, became part of the Shadows. And worst of all, I lost contact with Thaniel. I wanted to try and find him, but we couldn't stay. We would have all succumbed. When the Archdruid of the Grove, my predecessor, was seized by the curse, I had to lead the survivors to safety. That was my first day as Archdruid. An inauspicious beginning. You are right, but I must not lose focus until everything has been put right. I've wasted too much time already. Years in which nature has suffered. Oakfather, preserve you. What would you like to know? Anytime. Ah, Halsin is such a delight. Woe to the cultist who tangles with that thick hunk of an elf. Hmm, a savvy move recruiting Halsin to our cause. While I'm adept at most forms of weave manipulation, druidic magic is not my area of expertise. He will make for a most useful option to have in reserve. What's on your mind? It's about time Halson actually stepped up and joined us properly. He's certainly been taking up space at camp for long enough. You wanted something? Halsin's proved himself a fine ally already. He'll be useful in battle, if those tree trunk arms are an indication. Halsin is one hench elf. I'm impressed, and glad he's on our side. I 
think I'll enjoy traveling with Halson. Not for his wit or wisdom. He'll just make an excellent shield if we're attacked. I guess I can take... Fate, dost thou require a new... open to you. Just make sure you give care. Moon Maiden, protect and guide you. What's next? years ago, before the assault on Moonrise Towers. The Archdruid at the time spoke to us all, inspiring our courage. He was a fine leader. Nature's symphony in this place. Now, it is quiet. Quiet and dead. I can make some animal noises if it will make you feel more at home. You bleat well enough as it is. Under their noses.
It's hot in here. something. going. Hells. The curse is torn up in the ground itself. no fun. All I wanted was to play! Can't afford to stay idle. Let's move. Hide and seek. That's him. 
like an echo of Thaniel, remolded by the curse. We need him if we're to put a stop to all of this. Will you play with me? for myself. I get to play all the time. Yes, I do. You can't make me do anything. <laughs> I don't want to play with you anymore. He's fled. We need to track him down. Wherever the curse is the strongest, that's where he'll go. That's where he'll feel safe. regards you lifelessly. Deathka, warrior for my queen, blade for my Kithrak. Foolish games, shadow, ambushed, shameful death, dishonor to Vlakith. Not in the Shadowlands, Atop the mountain reaching to the sun. The corpse remains silent. It does not know. Training. Becoming a Sar. Leading my kin. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. Road ahead. I do. 
Leave me alone. Why can't I just stay here playing? I had everything I've ever wanted right here. And you've ruined it. I'm not leaving. You can't make me. Be gentle. He's much more than a child. But he doesn't truly know that. to me. He left me here all this time. I had to do everything for myself. Even when it was scary. Even when I was alone. I didn't give up. But would he even want me back? I've changed. A lot. So I wouldn't have to make up friends to play with anymore. I'd have someone real. I'd like that. And he would too, I think. All right, I'll do it. I want to do it. Well done. Are you crying? You're a bit big to be crying. But I suppose that's okay. Bye. And thank you for playing with me. It's done, at last. Soon the land will be unshrouded. We should return to Thaniel when we can. <gasps> Ketrick Thorn shown in Salunite armor. Is there any god that turncoat hasn't bowed to? While I was sleeping, he spoke of you. Said that you fought shadow and spite to restore me. A hundred years of sickness almost ended. I feel every root that riddles the earth beginning to unfold. But there is one anchor, still holding the shadows in place. The soul that brought it into being, for the land to heal. Ketherick Thorn must die.
Oak Father preserve you. Catherick's soul still nourishes the shadows. Destroy him, so the land may heal. So that I may heal. Oak Father preserve. So, I'll remain with you. If you'll have me, then. So do I. But one duty at a time. I've been unfair to you. I've had unrealistic expectations of your character ever since I joined you. But, honestly, you've surpassed even those. Seems my faith was more than well-founded. What would you like to know? Anytime. Greetings.